So you guys just seem to love it when I bury myself alive. I don't know why, but it's cool being buried alive. <laughs> what, the, what the hell am I talking about? I've been buried alive twice. First time under normal ground, second time under water. This time I'm gonna be doing it again, but under sand. I mean, there's not many things that you can actually bury yourself under. So if you guys like this video, smash that thumbs up button and that'll let me know whether to do more because I've got some more ideas what I can be buried alive under if you like this one. So let me know by smashing that thumbs up. I just said that. I've just woke up, I'm tired, I'm not making any sense. <laughs> <laughs> so let me just start again. I'm gonna be burying myself alive. So as always, I'm gonna go buy supplies. I'm gonna go buy a box. We're gonna go to the seaside, dig a hole, put me in it, bury me under sand. Why not? <laughs> so Moon does not want me to do this because it's dangerous. Moon's actually a trained nurse, but there's only so much she can do when you know when I'm buried alive under sand. She can't like get in there to me fast. This is very dangerous. Don't try this at home or anywhere because this is just stupid. And as always, don't forget go follow me on Instagram. Link in the description at KillMFDW and follow him back. Go follow me. Or on Twitter as well. Link's down there too. I hope there's not many people at the beach going to be watching me because this is going to be embarrassing. I mean, it's September. There can't be that many people on a beach in September. If you didn't watch my last video, right? Look at this. Look at that. That is insane. That's, bru that's bruising. If you didn't watch my last video, I duct taped myself to a wall for the entire night. And I didn't get it on camera, but this is the aftermath. There's going to be a link to that right at the end of this video. Don't click off this video. Go press that when you finish watching this. Go watch that, because that was crazy. That's one of my favorite videos I've ever done, seriously. So, go follow me on Instagram. Watch that at the end of the video. Me and Moon are now going to go buy our supplies, buy the box, and then go do this thing. Here we go. You know we can't do this anymore, don't you? What? Spending all that money on supplies. Right. It's not right. I'm gonna set your limit of £5.50 now. For food and drink? Yeah. Just £5.50. So I'm just editing the video right now and I'm not too sure if this actually makes sense, but I've got to spend exactly £5.50. Can't spend any less or any more. It's got to be exact. Oh, and I also forgot to mention earlier, if you're new, subscribe. And if you've already subscribed, press the notification button and you'll be notified every time I upload. A bit of a weird time to say it, but go and do it! Okay, let's carry on. So I get a sandwich, cheese and onion, that's £1.10. I really want Capri some, but it's like a weird 89p. Go on then. Uh, I get some crisps, I get some cheese and onion and salt and vinegar, so that's exactly £1. We're on a budget, so I get a small can of Coke, the smallest can I've ever seen in my life. 40p. Go £1.10 for the sandwich, 89p for the drink. 40p a bag. No, it was 50p each, 50p, for an extra yeah. pound, plus the drink was 40p, £3.39. What have I got left? £2.11p? Yeah. Uh, get some habanero chilli peanuts, they sound beautiful, £1.20. Quick calculation, i got 91p left. I've got to spend it, exactly. Yeah, that's the challenge, in the challenge, you know. 90p, 91p. Uh, oh, 90p. Some chocolate fingers. Oh, I love these pee. as well, the white chocolate it's ones. 91p. Yeah. Oh, I've got one P there. Yeah. Good luck. I don't think you can buy anything for one P. Do you know if you sell anything for one P? 10p, probably cheapest. 10p, cheapest. They don't sell anything for less than 10p. I'm 1p off. Yeah, well. £5.49p, fail. So this is the box I used in the last Mary Self video. No, not Mary Self. Oh, I'm not doing it again, I'm not doing it again. <laughs> so this is the same box I used in the last Buried Alive Underwater video. I used this exact same one. I mean, I could use this again. I fit in it and stuff. I don't want it to be the exact same video, you know? So I'm just gonna make my own box out of cardboard. They should sell cardboard here, shouldn't they? Yeah, moving boxes. Yeah, but yeah, we'll go and have a look. I've got the Bro Controller, like a hundred to choose from. <laughs> this is the biggest box they sell. Five tiny ones. <laughs> I can't do that. I mean, it covers your bum. I have to buy all these and like duct tape 25 boxes together. That's not even gonna cover you. Ow, oh, but... What if we're buying a door? 
if we buy a door. <laughs> We're gonna buy a door now. I don't get it. I'll explain in the car. We just need a shovel. Let's go, come on. Unlike Jack, this door's gonna save me. <laughs> Do we both fit on yeah. it? It's gonna save me, this door. Got that shovel here. That one. <laughs> that one, that behind it. Oh, that one. <laughs> you won't get far with that one. Does it fit in car? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought about it. Oh God. <gasps> no! No! <laughs> Paintwork's ruined, it's ruined. <laughs> Think it's going? Yeah. Easy peasy. It's not as good as we thought. Whoa. <laughs> and I drive like this for two Just hours. To say <laughs> this is why we've got the door. So here's the floor. The floor, that's the beach. This is the beach. This is moon. That's me. Here's the hole. And then what you do is this. You have to dig the hole like this. The door sits on there, and the moon, over here with the shovel, fills this in. So there, that's my... That's my idea. If you forgot, this is me. This is moon. This is shovel. This sand. This is the beach. Oh god, yeah, I think we get it. Go on then. Go on then. You know that your hair is going to be ruined. It always takes him ages. At least two and a half hours. Nice. Quite a lot of space <laughs> you got here. Let's get digging. It's going to be a hole that big. Oh, I've got an idea. Got to go around it. That's it. It's a hole. Yeah, we're going to be a while. See you soon. There's the hole. We're, we're starting to fill up with water. I was hoping we could get a bit deeper than that before water started coming in, but. We're gonna have to change plan, change plan. I think we have to dig down deep enough just so I can lay in it and then just put the door on top and then just put sand on top of the door. Just make like a hill on top of me so I can't push the door away. Police are coming. Somebody's reported to the Coast Watch that they've seen you coming down and you're burying the car door. Well, that's obviously not a car door. Oh, oh no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> what? You're burying a stolen car? <laughs> My bag can just fit there like that, and I lay down. There we go. So this camera's gonna have to be here like this. You're gonna have to see my double chins and stuff. <laughs> go on then, put door on. Let's see if it works. That's it. And now you need to fill sides up and then throw loads on top. It's getting darker. Uh oh. All the way around. It's nice and tight up to the thing. It's just this last piece, and then as soon as this last bit's in, it should go completely dark. Bye. Oh! <laughs> Completely dark. Oh, I should have got that torch ready first. Oh God, where is it? Yes. I don't like this. I do not like this. <laughs> no! You're gonna start throwing sand on top. All right, three, two, one, go.
This is what we've got. Let me show you around. Room tour. This is it. This is everything. My feet are down there. My bag. I really do not like this. I just need to calm down and stop myself from freaking out. I don't know how much oxygen I've got in here. I don't know if oxygen can get in through the sand. I don't know. I don't like this. Moon! Can you hear me, Moon? Moon! Moon! So me and Moon have, uh, well, the the deal is when I want to come out, I call Moon on my phone. Um, should be in my pocket. <sighs> I haven't got my phone. I haven't got my phone. Last I remember, I put it in Moon's bag when I was digging because I didn't want it to fall out of my pocket. <sighs> How am I going to tell her? How am I going to tell Moon? When I haven't... How am I going to tell Moon when it's going to come in? Moon! Moon! I ain't got my phone! Moon! 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 I've just got to try and not freak out. But the more I freak out, the more oxygen I use up. I don't know how long I'm going to be here. Just got to hope Moon realises that my phone's in her bag and then she can dig me up in a suitable time. If she doesn't realise, she's just going to be sat there waiting for me to call and I'm not going to call, obviously, because I've not got my phone. Could be here a long time. I just keep, I can't stop it. I keep freaking out and panicking. You know, my, my natural instinct isn't to just grab the camera while I'm doing it, so I'm not, not getting it on camera, but I've just been banging and scratching so hard. I peeled this film off the door. I feel like it might get caught up in my mouth or my face and suffocate me or something. I don't like it, I want it off. This is the hardest one of, this is the hardest challenge I've done yet. I've got nothing. Nothing to take my mind off anything. Nothing. I've got no phone for entertainment. I've got nothing except food and drink. And that's it. That's all I've got, literally. So I'm currently underneath the beach with a door on top of me and then a huge mound of sand on top of the door. I can't lift the door off. I've tried pushing the door. Ugh. I've tried pushing the door as hard as I can. I keep getting sand in my eyes. I can't, can't lift the sand at all. There's just so much on top of me. I just can't do it. Anything. <sighs> oh. It's all warm and soggy. I'm getting so uncomfortable on my back. I need to move. Oh. Oh, I've got quite a lot of room in here to be honest. I mean I can move around a little bit. I can hold the camera comfortably It's not like insanely tight in here. I mean, I've just been eating stuff. I've had a sandwiches I've had them chocolate things. I might have a bag of crisps next probably then But there's really not much to update you on I'm literally just laying here, you know, I'm just trying my best not to go crazy That's all I can do if I had a little bit less room in here I'd be going crazy because I'd start freaking out. I'd start panicking. But because I can move my arms and legs around a little bit, I'm pretty much, I'm good to go. Got a little bit of like a ramp here. Get my head in there, nice. My feet. And I could just like, just touch the bottom with my feet. I'm not cramped in. Not cramped in or anything. The air is getting real thick in here. Like really hot, really thick air. <sighs> It's just, it's just like all of a sudden, from nowhere, I just start panicking, and I don't know why. I don't think of anything b bad or anything. I just start, I can just start freaking out and panicking from nowhere. It literally just feels like it's from nowhere. I can't keep track of time or anything. 
but it feels like every 10, 15 minutes I just have a little panic freak out. If I had my phone, this would be completely different. I'd, be, I'd feel completely different. Maybe I could have my phone right now and I've got no signal under all this sand, so I could still possibly be in the same situation right now if I did have my phone, so I'm just thinking of that. That I, This could still be... <laughs> we should. I should have agreed a time with Moon to get me out, like, no matter what, you know, like... If you don't hear from me or anything, something like that happens, then just get me out by three o'clock, four o'clock, five, whatever, you know. And uh, But we didn't schedule anything, which was stupid. Oh, Moon, I just hope you find my phone and realise. Oh. Oh, I'm really wet. Look at my clothes. My clothes are so wet through. Why are my clothes soaking wet through? Just on my back where I'm laid. I'm really hoping not, but I'm thinking that the, the, the tide's coming in. As the tide's coming in, the water below me is rising. And I'm kind of going to be end up laying in a puddle of water. That's just like my guess. But looking at my clothes, right now that's looking like what's happening. It is actually really cold in here. From me breathing and stuff, the air is really hot. And it's getting quite difficult to breathe. Uh, the... Uh, but the actual sand I'm laying on and around me is actually freezing. So it's a weird mixture of hot and cold. I'm just really hoping that as that tide gets closer, I don't end up in a pool of water before the tide even gets close. Because Moon's not going to know from the outside that I'm laying in water in here, you know what I mean? She's not going to know that. <laughs> if she decides to wait right until the tide's getting close to get me out, but I could already be laid in water before then i could do all... <laughs> yeah i'm not gonna say what could happen because it's kind of freaking me out okay change subject change subject okay this is the stupidest thing i've ever done i should have got the box i should have just got a waterproof box but i just didn't want the video to be exactly the same as the last one so i just thought i'd make it a little bit different you know but <sighs> this was i didn't fully think this through i rushed i rushed into this decision because I want to try and get the video out in time. I really want to just want to... <laughs> I'm going, I'm going. I want to dig out, I want to get out. Jesus Christ! I want to get out. I want to get out. But I don't want it to collapse in on me. If I start digging, it's just going to come down. No. No. I feel like I've just run a mile. I feel out of breath. The air is getting low. The air is getting oxygen. It's getting low and thick. This is stupid. Oh, I feel weak. Oh. Oh. Tide's coming. I can hear it. You must be getting close. Come on. Oh, keep digging. Come on. Keep digging. Try to push the door. Try to push the it. I can't press it yet. Oh, it moves slightly. I can only move it slightly. Oh, hello. Come on! Ah, uh, oh, quick! Uh, come on! Uh, oh, oh. It's getting really sludgy in him. Oh. Uh. Now it's starting to fill. It's starting to fill up. Moon, it's all cracking. It's all caving in. I can see it. I can see daylight. 
quick, grab that. Quick! 